I have a question for you. What happens if you display your phone number on your website on a number of pages, but then you have to change your phone number and you have to go individually on every single one of those pages and change it manually? You don't have to do that anymore. We've released a new feature which allows you to manage your company information from one single place. Let me show you how you can do that. How's it going everyone? My name is David from Thrive Themes and in this video I'm going to show you first of all how you can set up your company information from this one special place and then how you can display these elements on a normal landing page and then on a smart landing page. But first let me show you how you can set up this information. So we're in the Thrive dashboard and I simply scroll down until I find the smart site option. So Click on this. This is the global fields page. This is where you set up your uh, company information. So you have three sections. As you can see, I've already set up mine. The first one is, you know, basic information about your company, your address, your phone number, email address, all that stuff. Then you have your legal section, right? All of these links. And then your social section, right? With all of your uh, social media accounts. First of all, these are uh, added here by default, right? If you want to add your Twitter account, for example, you can always click on add field. In the first drop down, select social. And here you can select link, right? Because you want to send people to a certain link. So it can be Twitter, again, Twitter here, or follow me on Twitter or whatever. And here you simply display your uh, account URL for Twitter. And there we have our Twitter account. Now, what exactly is the point of this page? Well, as I said in the beginning, if you ever change your phone number, you don't have to go individually on the pages where you have displayed it. You simply come here to the phone number field, you select this pencil icon, and you simply write down your new phone number, right? Whatever that is. And then you save it. And just like that, the phone number has changed on your website wherever you have displayed it, right? Using this, uh, using this feature. Now, let me show you how you can add these elements on your pages. We'll start with the normal Thrive Architect landing pages. So this is a normal Thrive Architect landing page, which looks really cool, by the way. And at the top here, we have these two elements, right? Your address goes here and the phone number, right? Instead of this text here, we're gonna remove it. And right now we're editing a text element, right? This is very important because on the text element, this panel will show up. So what we're gonna do, we wanna display our address here. So we'll click on insert short code and simply select the address option. So we'll insert it. This is my address. It's rather long, but you can adjust it, right? You can drag this over here to something like this. The phone number can go that direction. You know, you can adjust it however you want. It's basically a text element, right? And then the phone number as well. We can select it, remove this and simply select the phone number field. Okay. And this is the latest phone number that I have updated, right? As you could have seen in this video, I changed the last digits of this phone number. And it's very easy. You know, if I change this again, it will automatically be updated on this page. And you can do this whenever you're creating a new landing page uh, in Thrive Architect. But let me show you what happens when you're working on a smart landing page. This is one of the new smart landing pages. And I hope you've seen the video about the smart landing pages. If not, you can check it out right there because they're awesome. So basically what happens is that on a smart landing page, these global fields are already added on the page. So you don't have to add them yourself. So here, for example, I have my social accounts already added and you can see this dotted line underneath them, right? This means that they are short codes. So I have my social accounts here. I have my company name, right? The disclaimer, privacy policy, GDPR, as I have named it, everything is in there. And of course, you know, if you want to add something extra, you can always do that, right? You can add a text element on page, you know, go on the panel, click on insert short code and add whatever a global field you want. What's also really, really cool about the global fields is that you can display them on many pages of your website. And you know, if you change them from one place, they change on those other pages as well. 
but only the content changes. The styling of these global fields is flexible, which means that you can edit the styling on one page and it doesn't affect the styling on the other pages as well, right? Which is really cool because, you know, probably on this page, I have this certain vibe going on, but on this other page that I've shown you, you know, this is a totally different vibe. And that's just fine, you know, it allows you to keep the actual content, which is very important, and change your styling from one page to another. And basically, that's about it for this video. I really hope you enjoyed this new feature. And of course, don't forget to check out the smart landing pages. Don't forget to check out Thrive Architect because we're constantly adding new features into this awesome plugin. And it might be the exact thing that you need in order to build a conversion focused website for your business. And of course, don't forget to give this video a like if you enjoyed it, which I'm sure you did. And of course, subscribe to Thrive Themes. And with that being said, see you guys in the next video.